friends. Today I'm going to show you how to add one digit numbers to two digit numbers using 10 frames, chips, and number bonds. Make sure you have a pencil and paper or wipe off board with you. Are you ready? Let's go. Let's start with 35 plus seven. I'm going to break up the seven to make the problem easier to solve. I have 35 shown with 10 frames. I'll add seven chips. As I add the chips, I'm going to put them in the 10 frame until I fill it. Then I'll put the rest outside the 10 frame. Watch. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Do you see how I filled the last 10 frame with chips and then put the extra outside? I'll show that in my number bond. I added seven chips. I put five in the 10 frame and had two extra. So in my number bond, I'll show how I broke up seven into five and two. Now I can write a new equation that's easier to solve. I have four 10 frames filled, so that shows 40. I have two extra, so I'll add that to 40. 40 plus two equals 42. So 35 plus seven equals 42. We made an easier problem to solve. I'll show you another one, then you'll try some with me. For 66 plus eight, I have 66 shown with 10 frames. I'll add eight. I'll start putting chips in the last 10 frame and put the extras outside. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. To fill the 10 frame, I added four chips in the frame and four outside. So I broke up eight into four and four. I'll show this in my number bond. Now I can write a new equation. I have seven full 10 frames, which makes 70, and I have four left over. So I'll add that to 70. 70 plus four equals 74. So 66 plus eight equals 74. Now let's do some together. Get your paper and pencil or wipe off board. Write the equation 57 plus six and make a number bond under the six like I did. You can pause while you write and press play when you're done. Press pause now. Here's 57 in 10 frames. We need to add six, so we're going to break up the six by adding some in the last 10 frame and putting the rest outside. How many chips do we need to fill the last 10 frame? We need three chips to fill the last 10 frame. Did you get that? Right now, put that three in the number bond. Now, we were supposed to add six. So far, we've added three. How many more do we need to add? We need to add three more. So we broke up the six into three and three. Make sure you put the three we just added into your number bond. Now we can write our new equation. Look at how many complete 10 frames we have. Write that number down. We have six complete 10 frames. So you should have written 60. Now you just need to finish the equation. Do you know what we add to 60? Here's a hint. Look at the extra chips outside the 10 frames. Finish writing the equation and solve it. We had three extra chips outside the frame, so we needed to add them to 60. Your equation should have been 60 plus three equals 63. Did you get that? Let's try one more. Write down the problem 35 plus eight. Press pause while you write, then press play. Press pause now. Here's 35 with 10 frames. You have a job to do. 
Break up the eight by figuring out how many chips go in the last 10 frame and how many chips are outside. Create a number bond under the number eight and show how you broke it up. Press pause while you work, then press play. Press pause now. You needed five chips to fill the frame and you had three left over for a total of eight. Your number bond should show five and three. How did you do? We're not done yet. Your next job is to write a new equation with the total number in the 10 frames added to the number left outside. Write and solve that equation now. Press pause now. Your equation should have been 40 plus 3 equals 43, which means 35 plus 8 equals 43. How did you do? You just learned a strategy to make it easier to solve two-digit plus one-digit addition equations. When you turn your first addend into a 10, the problem is easier to solve. Don't worry if you didn't get it. Just keep practicing and it will come to you. See you next time. Make sure to subscribe for more engaging math videos.